I'm PGA Golf Professional Ray Cutright. I want to talk to you a little bit about a term that's been around for a long time today, club repair. And over the years, it's evolved into the term club fitting. And most of us as golf professionals now understand the basics of club fitting. We've got incredible equipment to help us do it. We understand more about ball flight. We've got cameras. We've got everything you could possibly think of to give the student the visual look of getting the equipment they need. But let's go back to club repair. When I say club repair, I say I mean understanding the basics of grip sizing, how it fits on a certain shaft, understanding shaft flex, what a shaft causes a golf ball to do with a certain handicap player, loft, lie, length, and what we can do to an existing set of golf clubs when someone comes in, doesn't want to make a change, or when we're teaching them making them understand and you understanding how you can adjust that equipment to their needs. And again, getting across to them that you're making a long-term investment in them and they may need new equipment down the road. But for the time being, you can make adjustments. It's very hard to teach someone with very poorly fitted golf clubs. Worn out grips, lie that's maybe two or three degrees too that far off causes has a definite influence on ball flight and ball solidness of hit. Those are the things that I'm speaking about. And most important, you're trying to develop a relationship with your player. They want to trust you, not just in you teaching them a swing motion and how to play the game, but also you understanding their equipment and where they are with it and giving them the best possible scenario they can have to play better golf.